Hello everyone, I'm your host Rabab Zehra from TechX Media, live from Jitex Technology Week 2022. As a guest, I have with me right now Prashant Menon. He is Channel Manager UAE at Checkpoint Software Technologies. So we will have a conversation with him and get to know more, uh, some information about the company and about his channel strategy in the region. So let's welcome Prashant and TechX Media. Hi Prashant. Hi Rabab, how are you? All good, how, how, how is it uh, going at Jitex? Oh, it's, uh, we are actually excited to be at Jitex 2022. Uh, for the past two years, if we look at it, the footfall was not so great, but this year we see that uh, people are erring to yeah, go and they want to be here, right? So I think year. that's really great. And yeah. uh, I also want to thank you for this opportunity to talk to TechX. Uh, it's a pleasure it's a always pleasure. talking to TechX. Yeah. It's a pleasure to have you here with us. Thank so you. coming to the point, as you are a channel manager for um, in UAE for Checkpoint Software Technologies, what was your channel strategy uh, in the year 2022 uh, in UAE particularly? So channel strategy in terms of 2022 has been very simple. We are basically focusing on two main aspects. One is growth and the second one is partnership. Mm -hmm. Growth, purely to grow with partners, mm -hmm. grow our install base, grow with our new technologies. It's absolutely paramount that our partners grow along with us. This is very simple for us and uh, it's only when partners grow with our technologies would they be interested continuously with our technologies and we make a conscious effort to make sure that that is done. That's, that's interesting. And secondly, when it comes to partnership, even there we would like to keep it very simple. We are always looking for new partners to come on board. We make sure that uh, we take them through the horizon of our solutions and we take them through the, uh, the schema of enablement, training and certification to make sure that they are actually out there to take care of the latest cyber security threats which is absolutely important because the ever evolving threats is definitely posing a problem to the industries around and we want to make sure that our partners are absolutely ready to you know, take on them. And uh, apart from that, uh, if you look at it, from our perspective, it's also important that we coin certain strategic alliances with certain leaders out here. Okay, So from that particular perspective, it's a conscious effort that we are doing in the market to sign up with them and take things forward. That's that's great. So you uh, talked about partnerships. Are there any partnerships of Checkpoint that you have signed recently or is there anything in the pipeline for rest of the 2022 or 2023? Yeah, our market strategy is to make sure that we reach as many partners as possible because we truly believe that uh, we have one of the best security solutions around, okay? And our tagline clearly says that our customers deserve the best security. So from that particular perspective, we really need to sign up with the best. We have signed up with a global VAD, which is Westcon recently. And uh, we are sure with their experience in this particular market, they will be able to take us to some new partners and uh, you know open up some new relations for us in this particular region so from that particular perspective we are very excited secondly when it comes to partnerships what immediately comes to my mind is a global aspect that we have done in terms of partnership we have recently signed up with uh, clarity and medigate mm -hmm. so medigate was taken over by clarity clarity mm -hmm. is for the traditional iot side of things whereas medigate has got to do with iomt where we are actually trying to secure healthcare industries so from that particular perspective also, we are pretty excited to you know, tie up with them in this particular region and we are already in the market along with them. Uh, last but not the least, we also see that there is quite a lot of skill shortage in this particular region. Okay, so from that particular perspective, again, this is an ongoing journey and I truly believe that you cannot look at the training aspect as a destination. It has to be an ongoing journey and it's very important that Channel partners also look at it from that particular perspective where they are constantly making sure that their pool of resources are getting trained on a frequent basis. So for that reason, we have increased the number of partnerships with ATCs uh, as such. Okay, So we are signing up new ATCs also and uh, that is something which will make sure that the new uh, blood which is coming into the cyber security industry has got the necessary impetus to take on the newly evolving cyber security threats. Yeah. That's, that's great. So, uh, as we are at Jitex and um, uh, you talked about the excitement and, and, and the footfall we have at Jitex this year. For Checkpoint, uh, what will be your key takeaways from Jitex this year once it ends uh, on Friday? Simply put, we are here to execute our strategies. I told you right at the beginning that uh, we have got a two-pronged strategy. One is to grow with new partners, actually. 
So if we do a good job in terms of uh, passing on the essence of our cybersecurity architecture, which is called as infinity, mm -hmm. uh, and if we are able to showcase value out of those solutions, I think we would have done a good job. Plus, as I mentioned, we are always on the lookout for new and strategic alliances out here. So from that particular aspect also, we are just making sure that we meet as many new partners as possible. And also, it is important to take care of our existing partners because these existing partners have actually ensured growth for Checkpoint in this particular region. So we are not leaving them, but it's just that if we have to get to the next phase, we need to also get uh, new partners who's in who's doing uh, different kinds of cybersecurity business and we are just uh, on the lookout for them. So I think this particular platform that is provided to us, which is Jitex, is, uh, is a fantastic platform to have that kind of an avenue. That's, that's great. And uh, thank you so much for your time and uh, for being here with us. We hope to ha have you again with TechX in future. Pleasure is mine. Thank you, Rabab. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned to TechX to know more about what is happening at Jitex Global 2022. Goodbye.